The only strategy that is guaranteed to fail is not taking risks. Mark Zuckerberg, founder of Facebook. Now you, you my friend, are an amazing accidental business owner. You are here watching or listening to this and your business empire is around you. It has been the best of times. It's been the worst of times. You've lost time, money, hair, sleep, and probably the odd friend or two along the way. But now is the time to grow. Now is that time to unleash what whole heap of amazingness onto the world, or is it? I'm Mark Fall, coach, author, and editor at Your Best Kept Business Secret, and let's talk about the last five ways you can scale up your amazing small business. Number one, just no. And that is not a quote to homage Grange Hill, but not only do you need to say no to time thieves as mentioned in a previous video, but you also see, need to say no to anything that is not directly aligned with your purpose, goals, mission, and most importantly, vision for your business. Scaling requires making some tough choices and ask yourself what functions really need performing and hire only the best qualified and most driven people. So say no to mediocrity. Number two, be adaptable. You need to be firm in the goals that you have set, but flexible and adaptable in how they're gonna be met. Harnessing and cultivating the ability to switch quickly in direct different directions is response to the market is a key to success. Go where your ideal customers are, do your research and adapt. It will pay off. Number three, work on your business, not in it. God, I hate that phrase, as it seems to have been coined by an American franchise business coaches. But reluctant credit where credit is due, it actually makes sense. Most struggling small business owners and entrepreneurs I know fail in this one area more than others because they're focused on the wrong things. Yes, we must get the work done inside our business, and yes, it's important to focus on the details. After all, it's small connected steps which gets you to the climb at the top of Mount Everest. But here is the rub. If you don't focus on the key activities which moves your business forward in a strategic way, you're doomed to stagnate forever. Grasp the importance of this point. Get some clarity on what core activities you need to be laser focused on as the leader and visionary of your business and then protect your boundaries around those actions. In other words, the house better be burning down for anyone to interrupt your actions of working on your business. Number four, focus on what you want to be and not who you are. Don't base decisions on where you are now. Base them on what you want to become. One of the first things I ask clients is what type of company do they want to be? Do they want to be a 1 million a year turnover, 2 million, 5 million, 10 million? You must have definite objectives and an actual vision for your business. The decisions you make as a 50 grand a year business are very different to the ones that turn over 10 million quid. Genuinely, if you want to become a 10 million pound business, you have to start thinking like one. Number five, continually invest in yourself. Your business growth will often mirror your own growth and personal development. If you refuse to grow as a person, odds are your business is going to suffer. Be coachable, seek out mentoring, and join a high-end mastermind group if you have to. The latter especially will massively catapult your business to success. Accountability and peer group support can really be easily overlooked when you're actually trying to scale your business. Now you see, the challenge for most small business owners and entrepreneurs is not starting a small business, it's actually scaling a small business. And scaling is both difficult and you need to make sure that you'll grow it sustainably. And to do that, you need all of these tips to make it sustainable. I'm Mark Ford, the original best kept business secret, and you can find out more small business interviews, practical news, advice, thoughts, and strategies that really matter and help you get the business that you deserve. So go and visit bestkeptbusinesssecret.co.uk and download our free online small business magazine. And you, my friend, I'll see you on the other side. Mm -hmm.